Hello and welcome back to our Zimbabwe campaign. Um, you might wonder where my manpower went. I just poured it all into this monument project because I'm thinking about it. And when I annex Bali, I'm not going to be able to build these anymore. Unless I take, I guess, Dharmic as a syncretic religion with my cult. Um, but I'm not, I, I want to get these to tier 3. Um, some of these temples and stuff. And to do that, I need to actually prioritize upgrading them. So it's going to cost me some some manpower, but it should be fine. We're down to 10,000 manpower now. Version to Doran, Iroquois. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Version over here should be interesting. Where'd you spawn? Up there. Tidore's over here. I know I just... Yeah. Sorry, guy's gonna siege down something. Where'd he spawn? He spawned over here? Yeah, he'll siege down that one province. Oh well. And we're gonna have Cebu pop. Okay. Pull back this guy. He needs to come down here to Candy. I guess I need someone else in Africa, right? Maybe I keep 80k over here now? Yeah, whatever. We'll figure it out. There's some order stuff I gotta manage. Um, I can now actually colonize this. I think we're giving all this to the great <laughs> the great Malian Empire that can't seem to deal with its own fucking rebels. Let's not do that fight. Let's hold off on that. Little Khan in Borno stuck there in that one province. Before I gain some separatists. The siege is done. They're marching over there. You should now be able to actually deal with the rebels on your own. Now that I've killed the army. Oh my god, we can get our... Oh, we just got a half price advisor. But we can get our, uh, our next government reform. Holy cow, it's been forever. Production efficiency and inflation could be good. Trade power, institution spread, eh. Trade efficiency, merchant stuff could be very good here. Corruption, trade company, governing cost. It's a hard one. Don't care about that one. Okay, so it's going to be between Embrace Economic Theory and the governing cost for trade companies. Can I see a breakdown of what's costing me stuff? We're barely under our governing cost. And uh, uh, we're, we're going to go for the money, the money angle. Sure, it would probably help, but we have ways around that trade company governing cost, and we're almost done expanding our trade companies anyway. I think we do the production efficiency here. Five percent might make us more money, though. I guess I'll go for the ten percent. Let's go for the ten percent. I like ah, uh, God. There's I, I don't have I don't want to crunch the numbers and get like a spreadsheet out. Global trade power. I like the inflation reduction. I like keeping this this value down. So we'll go for it. Let's see how I adjust this. Uh, I guess I already adjusted. Oops. Rebels over here. Doing the rebel stuff. Then in which got siege. Need to reallocate that army. That army's dead. Uh, let's just I just go and like get rid of these sieges. Need these dead. Part of this can fit 40, 40 troops. Uh, I'm at force limit. We'll just have to take the attrition. Then. Much 
Utani separatists. All of this goes to Molly. Stack white, there we go. Molly can defend it. No, my four defense probably is much higher than theirs, to be honest. Damn you, Sabu. Damn you. Where are my other three merchantmen? Are they being built still? They are. This guy, we're going to take him and put him over here. Reminds me. It does remind me. Okay. Finally got this to tier three. This one needs to finish. Best in tech. Sure. Not going to do that at the moment. Kawatani's in just peak. I'll take Katsina for myself. I just don't feel like keeping them in this war. And Nupe too. We're gonna feed you Kong and Songhai, and we'll annex the homie. Annex the homies. So we're gonna siege all that, deal with these Wadayan separatists. How the Persians doing? They're sieging a fort. We don't like that. How's our big good friend Russia doing? Let's look how his debts. He's debt free. Free of debt. Think he's willing to fight the Ottomans for me? Probably. They're they're rival, right? Great projects. Chicken it's uh call. We should do these ones, because these are the ones that have um are in my lands that I'm gonna directly occupy. doing Sebu and stuff. March back over this. So many provinces. Bad reputation. Bad reputation. Candy. That's over here. Lost our natural scientist. I just like paid for him. Darn it. You have a cheap artist though, right? Alright, this guy, he's cheap. Yeah, he's cheap.
bet you there's a ton of fetishism. <laughs> yeah, we've got the fetishist in America. Oh, that, that brings a tear to my eye. This war is going on for a while. Can you get these guys out of it? We can. That's not going to help with my overextension. <laughs> Tragic. Oh, I, I, keep, I do it to myself. I do it to myself. They only have 6k troops. We split the armies now in part of siege. not have those 3k units get uh, bopped by that. These are my rebels. Brunei who's getting down and oh, Look at Brunei being... He's helpful, at least. What are my Australians doing right now? Nothing. As best as far as I can see. Gosh. Need me more Brunei. Who did you spawn? Oh, yeah, I never took Makassar. I was having... An an extra crisis there, thinking that I fucking lost the province to rebels. Anything up here I have to worry about? No, now we can siege. Now we can go back and clear out these guys. This area's clean. I got peasants over here, but oh well. Bali. Jar and Sunda have joined the coalition. Give that to Bahamanis. <laughs> Bulls over here. Quite a lot of rebels for the region. Yeah, despite having none manpower, we're still managing to regain it fast enough to where we're not actually hitting zero. Which is handy. Center here. Didn't think they'd march all of those guys here. What? Get it? Yeah. They <laughs> spot again. Oh. The second you leave, this is the the effects of a long recording session. You can tell I'm being too fast. I want to just kind of, I'm anxious to get this campaign to a finished state since I have a lot of other things I want to do um, recording wise. I want to revisit Victoria is my number one thing to do. And um, 
don't want to leave this unfinished. I have a bad habit of forgetting about stuff during the series and not picking them up. Case in point, all of the multiplayer series we've started where either Brandon or Robbie have gotten busy and not uh, made time to finish them with me. Cough, cough, dead space. Cough, cough, uh, whatever the one with Arteon was. I forget the fucking name. Atomic Heart, that's what it was called. Oh, fucking ridiculous. your list. Those will get done eventually. I won't, let, I won't forget about them. But uh, I'm going to close this campaign out. I do love my um, my tra grand strategy campaigns. I always love finishing them, especially with EU4. I think this is probably my favorite grand strategy game, so I try to get them finished. I feel like game EU4 is a lot of just logistical macro, which can be troublesome. If I was playing on Speed 3, I wouldn't have that problem, but... Speed 3 is a little bit too slow for um, these kinds of things. I'm not going to make those trade companies. That'd be dumb. Actually, I could. That's a good I could just force myself to have the trade company achievement done if I just did that right now. Definitely possible. I need to do the jewel. Okay, yeah. I'm, I'm digressing. I want to just take everything and march my way east in Songhai. Rebels over here. They spawned again. Thought we were done with those. Guess we were not. Fertile rains, sure. Those guys. Over here, there should be some. out that guy first. Pulls popped somewhere else, didn't they? There's particulars there, I've got to remember. Ten. Oh yeah, there's one here. Thirteen there. That's what the ones that pop dead. Uh, Molly. Molly. And Molly. Now we're going to have to deal with the Molly and Rebels as well. There's no way we can take all of Songhai, right? Yeah, 238. And it's double that. Rush declared upon Sweden to cleanse the heresy. Do what you got to do. Kong, we need to finish off Kong. Uh, we can go ahead and march this guy back. He's no longer needed in this war. About to hit our cap on military points. Gonna develop some cows and some grain here. Deal with that. Some more grain. Some uh, indentured servants. How are we looking on this? Still spreading, still spreading very slowly. Oh well. Go back to this guy. Come here. Take this thing over here. Some Hermes. Hermes. Look for the siege icon. It's not my vassal. Or at least it's not somewhere that. Down here, I hope. I'm gonna assume it was like over here or something, or. Hmm. Do not know. Sankai is basically ready to get out of this. Same with Kong. Can I actually kill Kong? Probably not, considering how much it takes to occupy all of them. I can get close, though. They should, they should be gone now. Let's just assume I can knock you out. Like, let's take all of this stuff. Look how far we got. Great. Eat that. You little jerk face.
How's my extension? Still at 170. Where are these guys? Where are they? Oh. Tragic. Okay, we're gonna have to pull back from one of these guys over here. To deal with that. Thought that was my land for a second. Any tag? Dealt with those. Fourth there, we're chilling. <laughs> What's over here? Where is our African transport? Come down here. Let's take the fight. She talks, these should still finish. Oh, Lord. At least we dealt with the black flag issue over there. I even... It's two. Really peering everywhere right now. Okay, pull back that guy. We're kind of gonna have to sit in this floor until we deal with all these rebels. Until we deal with this overextension problem. What's this? What do they occupy? I don't know. Ten provinces? Where? What? What ten provinces do you occupy? up here? Is this like in the islands? Where's Tidore? Tidore's over here. It's been freed. I don't know. I have no clue where these rebels are. These noble rebels that apparently... Oh, they're Mali nobles. Okay, never mind. Never mind. That's why. I'm a dumbass. Found the problem. No, he could just not make it. Huh. Finally. Get out of this. Let me be free. Let me deal with these upstart rebels. Okay, wow. I'll have what dies pop up too. Hundred and seventy percent. It's all my fault. All sharing is good. Build some of this stuff here. See what the right province is. These guys are done. Let's put some money into upgrading this one. That money is more less important than manpower is for me right now. I want to get this done to tier three. Tomorrow, yeah, yeah, yeah.
a break real quick. I have to respond to Brandon. He just messaged me. We're right back. All right, we're back. We have a recording channel on our Discord that I go to whenever uh, I'm recording. And Brandon doesn't believe that when I'm in that channel that uh, I'm always just recording. He thinks sometimes I'm like, uh... oh, that's a good one to upgrade. I'm just like, I forget to leave the channel, so he messes me every time I'm in there. Good point to him, though. I do forget every now and then to remove myself from the channel. But I told him I was, in fact, recording. Maybe I can get that dude to play some Dead Space with me. Soon, Beha's gonna revolt. So, so frustrating. Ugh. Alright, we gotta deal with these guys, and where are you going? Okinawa? This last 100% of this... Um, this last 100 in income for the... Um, can't can't think for the hegemon is proven to be harder than, than the previous 90 percent it feels like previous 900 doesn't help that i'm rooting out 100 ducks of corruption holy cow go for the eyes Take that 50 morale of armies, that's awesome. Uh, we'll go ahead and do one of these, yeah. Okay, with those Antimorans. Oh god, we have those events again. Those guys out. Okay, how much is it going to take me to fully annex this guy? Overextension wise. Joking. Like 60% overextension. Okay. 60%. I can take that. I can I can deal with that. I want that fourth though. Like that. 64%. So we don't definitely don't want to take that. We want to get these guys core before I even think about doing that. Especially with putting out all these fires. Speaking of fires. Yeah, this guy's landed and we'll deal with that. to Okinawa. Points! Just print more money. Silly. Forehead. Are you still in here? Yeah, you are. I guess this makes sense since I'm actually annexing these guys now. Oh, this is at one of our core provinces. Improve relation with you. I can actually annex you soon. Fighting Portugal? Okay. Uh, no! Not Iceland, no! <laughs> Anything but them! They had so much to live for. Kind of stupid. Kind of weird. Hopefully, this 
this is all the buyers for down here. Ainu and Inchiwe. Extension. You know what? Just. No. I guess we're gonna have to fight those rebels. Wars! Yes! Deal with that. Lost our army reformer. We'll go for the maintenance guy. The rebels pop. I heard it. Where'd it go? Where'd they go? That wasn't it. Tea back. We're making tea again. Yeah. Oh yeah. 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 Let's 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 handle that real quick. Teleport them out. Build two more. I can't do it. My manpower is terrible. How close are we to getting our manufacturing stuff? Getting close. The good people of Bengal and Delhi just fuck off out of the coalition, please. Kindly. I mean this in the best way. Doesn't help that I'm getting a lot of a uh, call for peace right now. We'll go ahead and call back with uh, Dahomey. Well, let's put us at 113 again. In July. I'll sit on it. We'll sit on this. Nine hundred and thirty income. Tua and Shikanitsa. I'm cautious to expand those because they're not in my actual country. So what we'll do is we'll go and find the one that I was upgrading over here. That will be in our country. And I'll just speed it up. Speed that one up and we're going to save up and get the global modifiers here. say I have to have the active effect, it just says they have to be tier 3 and in my country, so here's hoping. Currently we have, let's look and see how many of these we have. Just this one. We have this one that's also in our country, but you have to have Muslim. Accept the culture. Okay, so we've removed the Congolese there, we can get that one. Muslim. Coptic. Muslim. Could get this one. That's why I'm upgrading it. Tunis! Why why would you do that? You <laughs> little little bastard. Oh wow, we've really uh gotten through these. August, this is July. Yeah, there we go. We'll take the peace deal. Some more core. And 
then we'll go back to improving with some people. All right, we're gonna take a second to stabilize this. We need to, I need to put some thought um, into where we're gonna expand next. We're almost done annexing Bali, which will be good. I think I'm gonna annex Dante, because they're not doing a damn thing for us. Russia's called us into this garbage war. Okay, you were winning this already, but I, I guess we'll, we'll do this. I was gonna fucking, oh, should've waited a month. Shoulda, coulda, woulda. Okay. Okay, oh well, we're in a war now. Um. So we're saving up our money for great power upgrades, as well as, um. As well as for getting the estate whenever it, or the institution whenever it pops. We're not gonna get enlightenment either. We might get industrialization. Maybe, I can maybe build a furnace here in some provinces. That's my next tech, right? Is the furnace? Yeah, it is. There's my second self-sustaining colony. We'll go and put someone back here. Sure, just front growth there. Should be a good chance for me to attack Persia. Never mind. <laughs> Son of a bitch. <laughs> okay, we need to start breaking people out of this coalition, doing this the smart way. Cars. Darn. You're all joined together. Malacca. Out of Bengal. Bengal is allied with Delhi, Pasai, and Malacca. They're all in the coalition. Man, you got any allies? Coalition dude? Ifka, maybe? Korea? Hmm. Uh, James Zhao, I like the Ming. Everyone's allied to fucking Ming. Okay. I think we just, we break this part. We gotta find some way to break this part. Radon, Transoxiania. That could be my guy. Gujarat. That's 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 my end. That's my end here. We attack Gujarat. Okay, we're gonna pull back with um We'll wait, we'll wait. We're gonna get we're gonna get more claims on Gujarat, and then when we get our man power up, that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna break the coalition by fighting Gujarat. In the meantime, I could do this span, this war. Um, I do want to build some more men here. We'll build those and do that war. Upgrade the BAM Citadel. by Zimbabwe. Oh. Oh! I didn't even know. Didn't even know. I'm just going to pull back with this colonist immediately. And then I'm just going to have him promote development somewhere. Sure. I'll just do that passively because I don't want to have to come back and micromanage that shit. We've got 8,000 ducats to get our next level of stuff. Go to manufacturing interior to now. Uh, Swazi. Take one. 
There you go. Austria's fighting France? How is Spain involved in this? Spain has to be involved in this. Hey. Looks like this war is going to be done easily. Actually. Oh. Oh, Austria declared on... Now? What is this for? You're attacking Lorraine who... Okay. Okay, I was looking at this like, well, how does this work? That should hopefully break up that Austrian, France, and Spanish alliance. Help me out there a little bit. I'm going to save up for this one. Marriage with Molly is gone. Hopefully he'll get us a fucking claim on something. I like this dude's incapable of doing his mission tree. Yeah, no, that's not gonna happen. Yeah, definitely Gujrat is gonna be our guy. That is our target. Okay. 50 ducats away from being able to handle all this stuff. What is going on here? Oh, I annexed them. That's what happened. Yeah, now we can't upgrade them. Okay. We could have kept it, though. Okay, I see how that works. Maybe we'll take the Dharma thing next, then. Um. Wow, okay. They are now part of us. I'm so sick of this. <laughs> this fucking molly. Not worth having them as a subject. I'm really banking a lot on getting this one cult from Fulo. It's kind of worrying me. Let's do some improvements on our lands here. Try to keep pushing us closer to where we want to be. Sorry, I need to save up for my institution. That's what we need to do. That is much more important for us. Keep us up on time with tech. Ten generals away from getting professionalism handled. Now so much more for me to worry about handling with that. Actually, now I have actually marching access to Molly. Do you have claims still? You do have claims on Spain. Not worth it though. Let's put our armies like right here. Ons box the Emperor. Praise be. Who knew they had it out? Rush, I think you've I think you've won this. Oh, you broke our, our fleet basing rights now. Those are gone. I like those. Tragic. Please, please, please. Please, please, please. Peace out of this war. I would like to annex my vassals. Dude, 
I don't need anyone to embark on my rivals. I wonder what there still is for them to... Like, what, what are they trying to get out of this? Other than putting a 74 stack on a 5% of 6% attrition for it. Disc, disc, disc. Shortly, my friend. Goodbye. So no war with France. Don't even have to do that. Danzig's dead. No! <laughs> they took Danzig. It's tragic. It's actually so sad. Let's get a guy on Gujarat here. I am the state. Flame throat. Wish I could. Gotta be close. Oh! Economic hegemon. We have proclaimed it. We will surpass. We are the economic hegemon. We are certain that we can stand against the world alone and be the dominant power. We will surpass Alexander and Genghis Khan. Odorant Doom Matuant. I don't know what that means. I don't know that. And we even get to take our texts on time. Things are looking up. Finally. Man, what do we, what do we, what do we, what do we, let's look at this. What do we get? What do we get? Monthly war exhaustion, mercenary manpower, garbage. Uh, development cost, minus 5%, good. Over time, we'll get goods produced, amazing. Minimum autonomy, 20%, amazing. Mercenary discipline, garbage. And then governing capacity, great. Compare that to this one. Trade power is cool. Naval engagement's cool. Failures, blah. Blockade efficiency, blah. Uh, liberty desire subjects, eh. Maybe? And then artillery damage from back row, pretty sick, but I still like the economic more. Military hedgeman probably would be objectively the best, but I just want the governing capacity since this has been something we've struggled with the whole campaign. And I want to finish our reforms. They're taking the mandate. They're just passing it around like hot potato. Also, I need to... Ooh, ooh. Someone's probably been screaming at me. Fix this. Oh, that's gonna be... Oh god, alone! When's the last time we had one of those? This is definitely in Molly. Two thousand ducat alone. Absurd. Good sir, can I ask you to please concede Mexico? Elephants! Oh god! Russia owes us a favor. Siege will take it. Please just concede Mexico. I don't want to spend diplo points on this. Kill one grand captain. We're gonna get our um, our annexations running, and then I'm going to call this episode here. I know we're about five minutes over of my target, at least. Um, how much does it cost? Ugh. Five hundred ducats of interest on that loan. It's only one month of income, but. Still not ideal. Super peace. And we now have a slightly stronger Zimbabwe in Mexico. We can actually do our tech stuff here. Our flag fleet could upgrade its ships. 
could finally actually build us a, a navy. There's barely enough money to build that. Let's go and annex Date. And then we'll probably get someone to handle the homies. Just want to get this done fast. We'll just pay the money. Alright. Now annex the homies. And I think our goal after that is going to be this war with the rat that I'm plotting. As our crown colony is smart enough to actually handle their own wars. Wow, it only took you 200 years. Also, where are these rebels? Rebels somewhere. Ah. Speaking of the homies. Them, and we're going to start getting our claim. I want like one or two more claims on Gujarat. Gujarat is expensive, right? This is 188, so we're going to get about half their provinces. I need to feed Bahamanis these provinces to get their mission done. If I look here, they have secure Kandesh. Got to take the Chinagar. Yeah, we got to gotta feed them some of the land. We're going to take all of Ceylon here next time we fight the Chinagar, and then we're going to feed the rest to Oh, months. Hopefully they'll get more claims than what they currently have, because it's kind of disappointing. They're going to be our big swinging vassal in this region. I don't think we're ever going to get a chance to annex them, which is fine. Um, the land we take from Gujarat should be enough to get us the West Indian Company done. We'll get that goal finished. We'll probably get another one from Nippon. Uh, I'm not going to do anything with Manchuria. I don't want to invade China. It's not worth my time. Um... But we're going to get our trade centers done here. We are at peace right now, so I could look around and maybe do, like, center trade three. So these are places that actually make sense for what I'm trying to do here. Oh, um, we need more development here. It's supposed to be upgraded. I'm going to start doing some center trade. That'll we'll, we'll, we'll carry that into our next episode. We'll upgrade these centers of trade, get that achievement done. Um... And yeah, we're just going to prepare for that Gujarat War. That's what we got to look forward to. But that's all going to be for later. Right now, I'm going to call it here. As always, I am Sean. This is the Blue Screener channel. Hope you guys have enjoyed. And I'll catch you in the next one. Later.